What's up, armies? Tehimangi back with another unboxing. Uh, you may have gotten a clue from the thumbnail what we're going to be unboxing today, but if you haven't, then here is a clue for you. I don't know if you can see it, but you can kind of get a clue, and you might be able to get a clue from this as well. Oh, is it going to focus? Never mind, it's in bubble wrap anyways. So uh, we're going to be unboxing some accessories to do with Hope World and August D. And another clue for you is this thing that I'm wearing. How do I show you this? Ah. So let's see if you can see this. Can you see it? Can you see what it says? I've been wearing this since um, December last year when I got it. So, as you can already tell from the title, I am unboxing fan-made goods. Specifically, uh, armies, and more specifically, Korean armies. So, all of these that I'm going to be unboxing today are Korean army fan-made goods. And the bracelet that I just showed you, um, you know, with the RM Mono, you know, Nubjun's handwriting, everybody says... Um, on that bracelet and I've gotten accessories from the same seller today. She has made other accessories and I'm going to be unboxing things from my favorite fanfic writer, um, also a Korean. Um, I'll show you an example of something that I got before from her. It's actually, it's a book she wrote. It's a legit hardcover book. I love this book so freaking much. It um it is my dream. It's basically she's living my dream. I write fan fiction uh, as you guys may have already seen by now or know by now I write fan fiction. I love writing and uh, she is writing fan fiction and at the same time promoting uh, messages that she feels needs to be you know uh Things, messages that she feels she needs to raise awareness about. And that's the thing that I write with my fan fiction as well. You know, like, I want to raise awareness on homophobia, depression, um, just, just things like that. And I'm jealous that she's managed to publish books and so many people have bought them, including me. And um, the thing is, I've already read the book for free on her website but it's so freaking good that i have i had to i just had to buy the book so as you can see it's like a legit hardcover small text um just i think how many like 427 pages and the 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 amazing thing about this, she even had like an author's note at the back, and I find this to be like just amazing. She even put a little thing at the back for like some sense of authenticity, and it's got like the character's name in it. So this one is um based. Uh, this one has is based on Jimin and Jungkook, and she's she's done like. Even just down to the smallest details, which I feel is just seriously amazing. So, look at it. It's got, like, legit cover, publishing number, just everything. It's just so amazing. How do I get this closer? There we go. Ugh, not doing a very good job. Anyway, this book is huge. And uh, I've actually never opened these. But these, uh, this fan art, like, some, some artists, fan artists, I'm sure that if you have seen these Korean fan artists, so they teamed up with her for her book, and they, ba they basically drew out, like, scenes, I guess. <laughs> There's even this little bookmark here. So I've never opened this, even though I got this book, like, ages ago. So I am opening this for the first time. Let me get this bookmark out. It's 
it's not a bookmark apparently it says here that it's a metal sticker uh like at the top here metal metal sticker and uh it's instructions on how to use it but basically basically it's um lines from the book i've read the book so i recognize the lines i've read the book several times so i recognize the the lines from the book and uh basically they say um this one line ana <laughs> turukkaya it's so cute it's jimin was having a really hard time and tungguk offered him a hug but it was kind of really weird at the time because jimin was a teacher tungguk was a student um it's not really like controversial or anything but she was trying to raise through the story she was trying to raise like more important issues that were going on in Korea at schools not so much the teacher student thing but uh but they were they were all legal um but she was trying to raise awareness on the things going on at school about how teachers treat students and how students with like who are richer have privilege and over the ones that are poor or that didn't have both parents and things like that and it's a really kind of fucked up social issue that's going on and she wanted to raise awareness uh about that which i feel is a great message and if you want i will do a live and talk about these issues because um i know some stuff about it also and if you are curious i would love to tell you anyway so this is the fan art that came with it uh, their um scenes from the book so <laughs> I'm not really a, a fan of this one all that much because it's just it's just a little bit like too cartoony. I I really enjoy the more realistic type um art more. So, yeah. Okay, moving on. Let us unbox the thing that ju I just got today. Okay, I'm hoping this is a less awkward angle. Hopefully we can see more of what is happening. Oh, my goodness. Oh, they're so heavy. There's actually several books. I couldn't even I did, I forgot that I ordered some. Um this one is a collective effort from different fanfic writers and I I've, I've read some of their other stuff and they're all really good. Um so this is a collection. Oh. Before we do the collection. Oh my god, this one. This book is called Anun E, which means this kid I know or this person I know basically. This fanfic is so good. I have never finished reading it because it got me so so angry and so upset to the point I cried and cried and cried. The characters were just wow, impactful, and I was just so angry with the Jimin character. And it's like I, I just, I never finished the story because I was just so upset. And wow, it it looks like a great book. Very, very professional. And look at this. Also, it says rally, and then cover by Nick Design. This is just wow. There's something in the middle though. There's like a blue. Do you see the blue line here? Let's check it out. Not really sure. Why is there? Oh, it's just a marker. Okay. I can't wait to actually read and finish it. Because, you know, sir, we're still in a fucking quarantine and I have nothing to do. Ooh, what is this? Why did it come with this book? Are you still in the new? 
and then you read that. Hmm? What? Is she promoting another book, perhaps? <gasps> yes, okay. So, I, I read a line just now that I was like, it, it says, 나를 잊었느냐? 느냐? That sort of ending is like Joseon Dynasty. I don't know if you watch like period Korean dramas. Joseon Dynasty sort of language. So I was like, and then you turn to the first page and it's this. So I think it's another one of her fanfics that you get for free if you purchase that, I guess. Yeah, and she even has like the helpful little words the helpful little because you know not everyone even koreans themselves like sometimes um they find it hard to know like the old language and they need like these footnotes like to explain even when you watch korean dramas um the the period dramas they also sometimes still have footnotes at the bottom when you're watching the dramas themselves Wow, so I have two books to read. This is exciting. No, I, I don't have two books. I have another one, which I'm going to open. This one, so this one didn't come with fan art, but I'm perfectly fine with that because I've got imagination. I don't need the fan art. Uh, okay, I apparently have four, four books to read. Look at this. As you can see, oh. No, it's better to look at it this way. Focus. Is it focusing? Are you able to see it? Okay, it says syndrome, right? Syndrome. And it's, uh... Oh, my god. There is fan art in here. I recognize a name straight away. It's called... NOD. I don't know if you follow her on Twitter or not. Oh my god, I'm so excited. Oh my god, you guys, I really am excited. So this book, I'm guessing, is the fan art, and this book is the um, collection of stories. So, um, this the syndrome series is is a bunch of it's a collective effort dif uh, written by different fanfic writers. And they, and they did like a collaboration all centered around different syndrome themes. Like you can see here, it says Munchausen syndrome. Uh, and then there's here the Peter Pan syndrome, narcissism, uh, Stockholm syndrome's right like up here. If you don't know what Stockholm syndrome is, it's like when you're held captive in a certain situation, um, let's say someone kidnaps you and it's supposed to be like a real like dangerous situation, like a panic situation, but because um, you, you adapt or you somehow, I don't know, adapt to the situation so much you fall in love with your captor um, and that Stockholm Syndrome. So that's like, that's like an amazing sort of theme to center around, and I'm super excited about that. So, is this like, oh my god, look at, oh my god, it is, it's a comic. This is freaking amazing. Look, you can clearly see Jimin's face. Cyrano syndrome. <gasps> so are these supposed to match up? Like, oh wow. So it's not just the right. Oh my god, you can totally recognize if you are a Tiku shipper or you just enjoy reading fanfics about them. I do. I I enjoy reading uh, the Jimin Chungkook ship. You would recognize this writer, this uh, this artist. Look at. Just look at the shape of Jungkook's nose right here, and how he, how she draws Jimin and Jungkook. This is probably like, hi, right? 
Gotta be. Hi. Wow. So, oh my god, I'm so excited. Like, the way they, the way they do their titles is like, Hold me now, and then they tell you what syndrome it is. The Tinkerbell syndrome, and then they highlight, like, even the English one over here, which says Tinkerbell. So, I guess you can always either read the story to find out, like, what kind of syndrome it is, or, you know, look it up, and then to understand the story better. <gasps> oh my god love the illustration for this do you see how beautiful this is look at it it's just so gorgeous oh, i'm ruining it by like scraping it across the desk i love this so much oh this one oh this one's by nod good night this is the kotaro kotaro syndrome i don't know what syndrome that is but oh my goodness, you guys, I cannot wait to read this. I really can't. I'm so excited. This is a gorgeous, gorgeous, gorgeous book. And uh, so I have, I honestly have four books to read. Yeah, this one has all the different syndromes as well. Just, But this one is just all full text. Happy ending, Munchausen syndrome. No? Yeah. Is that how you pronounce it? Am I pronouncing it correctly? This is by Rally. This is this is the one that I wanted to read the most. Because she is an amazing writer. She makes me cry so easily and uh rally's one is stockholm syndrome oh my goodness i am actually familiar with that i mean never experienced it but i'm familiar with that all right okay okay you must be really bored by now and you must just really want to um for me to open the accessories so i'm gonna do that right now Uh, so this person sent out the things when, um, the, you know, so we've had, like, the COVID-19 virus issues recently. It's, it's still ongoing, you know what I mean? So, um, she was really nice. Like, she packed, um, she packs other things in here. I'll just open this one as well. So she has other things in here, like, like the little, um, antiseptic wipes and this thing. I saw what she packed and it's meant to be like a, what is it? I, when I saw it. I, I told her, I said, it looks like a condom. And she was like, no, it's not. Oh, it's vitamins. Yeah, it's even got the little, like, lemon thing. So it's vitamin. <laughs> I said, I thought it looked like condoms. And she was like, no. So, okay. And hand cleaner. This is really nice. The hand sanitizer thing. So, okay. It even comes in this cute little pouch. I'm going to put it back. That's really sweet. It's really thoughtful. Like, I, I love these little touches. When, you know, when you buy something from someone and they, they just go the extra mile. It's always nice to receive these things. Okay. Alright, so we've got a Hope World. Uh, Hope World accessory and Augusty. I ordered one necklace and one bracelet, and I cannot remember which is which. Pretty sure Hope World is a bracelet, maybe? No, I think August D is the bracelet. I think that, um, yeah, I was discussing with my friend Hanjo, 
and I was like, uh, yeah, I think Augusty might be too strong of a design to wear as a necklace. Hope World seems more fun, I guess. Yeah, that's right. The Hope World necklace. It looks just so good. So good! Like, look at it. I wonder if you can see the design. How do I make it? Like, focus. Will it focus like it did my mono bracelet? Hello? Focus. Is it focusing? I don't know. Maybe this is too shiny. I'll take it out. In a second. Let me see what else is in here. Oh my goodness! Okay, so the pouch itself is really nice. It's made of a very durable, like, cloth thing. And it's sealed with a Hope World sticker, which you also receive as a separate thing. See? There's a Hope World sticker here. Um, and, oh, there's many Hope World stickers. Oh, wow. Let me open it. And there's also a sticker for your army bomb. I currently have two uh, army bombs for version 3, and I have one uh, map of the soul version coming up. So I will be sticking these for sure on my army bomb. Uh, no, actually I'm giving this one to my friend, Hanju. She deserves one. Okay, look at these. They are nice. I have three stickers. So, again, we'll be giving to my friend. Oh, oops. Because uh, they deserve it. And, uh, okay. Let's see. Uh, I'm also going to be doing, you know, a, a giveaway. Many giveaways, actually, pretty soon. Uh, on You can look out for that announcement uh, soon, and, uh, I might just put a sticker in the pack that I'm giving away. I'm doing many giveaways. There's gonna be a bunch. I have a ton of stuff to give, so I like the sound of that. It looks like a good quality chain. We're gonna take it out in a second, but just, just look at the chain. Like, you know, I've been wearing this bracelet, like, forever, and it hasn't tarnished. The material is comfortable. I haven't gotten a rash. I'm, I'm really allergic to silver, but it's, it's not, it's not a material, like, it's a good enough material that's not cheap, so it's not, like, it doesn't give me any sort of rash. But anyway, so that means if Hope World is a necklace, this means that my Augusty is a bracelet. So, let wait so just now i got this which i haven't really focused on it's a little charm so okay the seller is called spring june and uh you can see right here it says spring day of june at the top and um she she even has uh group orders for like international shipping so you can always just go to her page it's spring underscore june i think wait okay here spring days underscore june let's let's i hope you can focus hello oh is it focusing focusing let me take it out And take it out, and then you can see. The quality, really. Pretty good. Look at it. It's not gold or anything, but it's a good enough quality. And uh, she has international geos there. She's, like, taking orders all the time. So if you wanted these... You could definitely get this. Uh, I already opened the August D thing and I pulled out this. It is magnificent. It actually says August D on it. And in light of the recent 
the Chita music video. It's, I am so happy to have this right now. He was so hot in that. It's like, yes, Yoongi, take me to Hong Kong with that tongue technology. All right, so I have a Hope and I have an Augusty. And these little charms, like keychains, key rings, whatever, who were handmade. Like, she took so long to mail out all this stuff because she was like, you guys should have a gift when you order my stuff. Let me hand make you some things. And then it took a while to ship out things, but like, you know, they're cute. It's worth it. It's really good. I love the color for this. It is an excellent, like, color scheme. So, okay, let's move on to what is inside the little pouch for August D. So this should be a bracelet, right? Oh, yes! Oh my gosh, more stickers. More stickers, like I said, like, it's it's sealed, right? It's sealed with this. And then she also gives you the sticker. Uh, when I bought the Numjin bracelet, it, it came that way. It's this, It was the same way. Like, it had a bunch of stickers, and it came in that sort of pouch. And uh, it came with... Wow, this looks great. This looks awesome. So this is a sticker for your army bomb. Like all these like stickers like this. Uh, it's it's going to look so good. Really good. So yes. Really nice. I am I am really happy with my purchase. Let me tell you how much the necklace costs. It costs like about 14 15 dollars let let let's let me say that again it was either it was around no wait i think it was it was under 20 for sure i think maybe it was 16 17 for me definitely under 20 dollars for the necklace and once again i reiterate on how good the quality is the bracelet i got for about 13 14 dollars and like I said, I've been wearing it since maybe like 20th December. I have not taken it off even once. I sleep with it. I shower with it. I do whatever with it. And the quality is great. So, you know, for it's really value for money. So I would advise you to get yourself some amazing accessories. And so let me tell you, for under $20, you could get all this stuff. You, all, you get your accessory. You get your... Um, little charm. You get all these like stickers. Army bomb sticker. <laughs> I keep raving about it and I haven't even taken out the bracelet. So we're gonna look at that. Oh nice. It follows like the little Is this the chain that I ordered? It's such a huge ass chain. The chain is huge. I expected it to be little. I don't think this is the chain that I ordered. I think she got it wrong. <sighs> oh, look, you can see her email address. Because I really dislike big chains like this. I wanted the chain to be thin like this. So if you look at it, that one's really big and this one's really small, but it's whatever, you know, I'd still wear it. I would still definitely wear it. Uh, and I'm not going to make a big deal about it. It's, it's still really pretty. It's still really, really pretty and definitely a good buy. Um... It's not, it's really not easy for things to be sent <laughs> from Korea. I didn't join a geo for this. I had it shipped to my friend's address in Korea and then, you know, because her mom always sends her stuff from Korea to Singapore, then this, this stuff rode along with her stuff and then, and then she hands it over to me. So I pay zero shipping, actually, thanks to my friend. I'm going to test it out right now. Let's, because why not? 
the Augusty thing. I'm not going to take out the little sticker thing first. Um, yeah, we'll see. First, let's clear up the space a little bit. This is a messy space. I am really shit at putting things on with one hand, but we are going to try. Um, and anyway, I put on my Numjin bracelet with my own one hand. Oh, I'm gonna do okay, because these are big links, so maybe it was a good idea to get these big link things. My wrist is freaking small every time, that I, so I always have issues when I order bracelets, because my wrists are so small that, like, it would never fit the ordinary part of the chain. I always have to attach this header part in, in the extended part of the chain, and that kind of sucks. Wow, don't have nails. Oh my goodness. Oh. Okay, I can do this. I'm gonna require some focus. Okay. I'm gonna pull it a little bit more. Why? I'm so frustrated. Okay. If if only I hadn't like cut my nails recently. No! Okay, I'm just gonna link it to like the next available link so I don't waste your time in watching this. I could totally edit, but I, I want you to watch me struggle. <laughs> okay. Alright, so this looks good. It's maybe I did order this chain. I don't know. Oh fuck, I put it on the wrong way. <sighs> if you put it on the wrong way, this thing is gonna face you, and it's supposed to like fall down, right? Like, cause your hand's down like this, and when the hand's down, like then it's flipped over, and you can't flip it that way, cause the chain is only like one direction. So I've got to put it on the other way. I don't think I can. I've got to ask somebody to help me, because then you can't see the Augusty part at all. <laughs> I am a dumbass. But that's okay. But anyway. Okay, let's look at it like this. Look, it just... It's... It looks great, actually, to be honest. This, like, half part here and half part here. I might wear both. Anyway, look at the Numjin chain. So... The regular part of the chain... Like, normally people attach it at this part, extended part. That's why it's so big. But um, I had to attach it at the actual like tiny part where you're not supposed to be attaching things because my wrist is just so small, which sucks. Anyway, it is really good quality. I can't like say that enough. And you get so many free things with it. Let's bring this mess back. It's... It's a great mess. It, the quality is great. I, I keep saying that. So I hope you guys at least check her page out. It is Spring Days June. Is it going to focus or no? It focused just fine just now. So whatever. You guys know what it is. Yeah. Thanks for watching the unboxing. Please leave comments. I love hearing your comments. Uh, and if you have any questions, just ask them in the comment boxes as well. I will see you in the next video.